If you're afraid of your financial situation, first of all, I really understand you. I've been there, probably most of us have been there, and it's very difficult not to be afraid when your finances feel out of control or when you just don't have enough. The problem about fear is that it tends to expand exactly what you don't want. You may have noticed that the more you're afraid, the worse things get. And whilst it seems almost impossible to be anything but afraid, that's actually exactly what you need to do. So how do you do that? How do you stop being afraid and turn that fear into something else? There are a few things you can do. One is to practice relaxing, just relaxing about money so that you don't think about it in such a fearful way. But if you want to do the really powerful thing, what you do is you give yourself some time and you take your courage in your hands and you look directly at what you're afraid of. So if you're afraid of having more bills, you look at your bills and you start to sort them out. If you're afraid of running out of money, you look at what might happen, you look at the money that you've actually got, the money that you've got coming in, the expenses you have to pay, and you start to ask yourself the question, how can I bring more money in? If you're afraid that you're going to lose money, you look at where it is that you might lose money. You look at it with real honesty and see if there is anything you can do to prevent it, anything you can do to protect yourself in case you do lose it. So you get, you get straight with yourself. You stop pretending. The problem with fear is that it makes us pretend. We don't want to look at it. We don't look at the bills. We don't look at losing money. We don't look at what's going wrong and then we never get to deal with it. And the amazing thing is that when you allow yourself to look at it, especially if you could not be emotional about it, just look at the facts, then you will little by little discover ways of dealing with it. It's quite remarkable how it works. And yes, it takes some courage. It's much easier to be afraid than it is to be sensible and rational, but it really works to face your fears rather than to run away from them.